Hello, my loves. Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here today. We're going to get a love reading for you and your bae. So Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. That's what we're doing today. I think I didn't mean to rhyme that, but it actually works. It really works. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So timestamps are down below, guys, if you want a personal with me. I don't know. You might want to get in now because I'm starting to think like maybe I won't do personal soon. Uh, next. <laughs> I might not be doing personal soon. I'm on to the... I don't know, I don't know, guys. We're still we're still mulling it over. So you might want to get it in now if you want. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have next. Triggering. How they see you. We're gonna do that one before triggering, because I think y'all be triggering these people. <laughs> Shocking news. Okay, I like this. Alright, let's see. Holy Spirit, today, thank you. Let's tune into the collective of Gemini. Gemini. Talk me as I channel these messages, clear and concise, accurate messages for Gemini, please. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Guys, if this is not your reading, totally cool. Check out your um, your sun, your moon, or your, your other signs, okay? If it doesn't resonate. Next. Next up, chariot in reverse. What's next for this connection? Here's a pause. Hey, man, could be dealing with a Pisces, heavy Pisces, cancer. There's a pause here. So what's coming up, Gemini? Somebody needs to take a seat. Okay. Queen of Swords. Yeah. Somebody's getting a little bossy, a little pushy. I think it might be you. I think you might be laying down the law here. We have the world in reverse. Somebody's laying down the law. About what, please? Ace of Wands. I think somebody's demanding that there be more action. There, there, there be more, um, maybe, emotionality. You're demanding something. But it's like, until a blockage is removed, until you deal with that, like until you address that concern, nothing's gonna happen. Like there is a pause on the horizon for Gemini and this connection. What's the Ace of Wands? King of Cups, you just want more. I heard more emotionality. There it is, Page of Cups. Page and Knight of Cups. You want the King, but you're with a Page or a Knight right now. You want the King? Great, great. You have to be the Queen. Or vice versa, guys. You have to be the queen of swords to get the king of cups. That's what I'm hearing. You want more emotionality. That's going to be fine. You can have that. You can have that. But there's almost this energy of like, you need to pull away right now because it's just not working. You need to pull back. Start demanding things. Like, in your own mind, not in the 3D. We do not force somebody to change in the 3D, guys. That's manipulative as fuck and abusive. We don't do that. You pull your energy back and you go within Queen of Swords because right now you have, a, you have a break on the horizon with this person. How does this person see you, please? Ace of Cups. Nine, they see you as wish fulfillment and you know they do, but you're expecting them to say more. You're expecting them to give more. You're expecting them to admit it. The Ace plus the Nine of Cups is a Ten of Cups. You want them to tell you, like, this is, this is... I see you like this. They feel that way. They do see you as wish fulfillment, but you're not getting what you want. What's the triggering card, please, here for Gemini? World. I heard the world and a baby and a bet from the dead. <laughs> the fool in reverse, you guys. There needs to be a cycle closed. You, you see this person. You, see, you either see all men this way or all women this way. Gemini, you're viewing people this way through assumption, through the assumption of... They always have feelings for me. Always. That's never a problem. Gemini, that's never a problem. The problem is they don't fucking explain shit. They don't tell you anything. That's the problem. So what's triggering you right now is that they are, are claiming they don't want a new start forward, but you know intuitively that they feel emotionally overwhelmed even by how much they want you but they're not saying it. You need to change your thoughts. You need to start changing the way that you view this person and relationships, especially emotionality, especially people that come into your life, love you and don't say shit about it, okay? Needs to, needs to happen. You're being triggered for a reason. Next up on the horizon is a pause. You need to work on this. Shocking news for Gemini. Nine of Pentacles. Shocking news, you're about to be independent very soon. Shocking news, you're going to pull away and you're going to be much more, wow, in your own bad, bad boss energy. Could be dealing with an Aries, heavy Aries, and any Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Um, shocking news. 
your bad bitch era is on the horizon. You are going to be very independent soon. You are not going to be emotionally needing this person at all whatsoever. The irony, you're begging them for emotional validation, but you don't need it. Shocking news coming in is you don't need it. You're actually going to reject the shit out of this person. Soon, you're not going to need this at all. Four of Cups. It's like they're going to offer you the cup of love and all of a sudden you're just going to be like, eh, whatever, I'm bored with this. That's shocking news coming in for Gemini. All right, let's, let's keep going. So let's see, Libra. Hi guys, somebody was so polite and, and reminded me that um, I didn't put the timestamps right away. So thank you for being patient, guys. I'm sorry, I'm trying to learn as I go to. I'm, I'm trying something new, you know? I'm trying something new. I normally do readings on live streams, but you know, trolls suck. So I'm not, I'm not doing that shit anymore. My energy is way too fucking important for that, right, Libra? We understand all too well, don't we, Libra? <laughs> energy. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If it's not your reading, go check out a different one, okay? <laughs> I can ask if I give a fuck. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I don't. You can ask me what the answer is. No, I don't give a fuck. 616 on the clock. Oh, that's interesting. That's the devil's number. Tell me why I feel all of a sudden like saying, like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Tell me why. Guys, what's this? Libra, what's this? What's, th okay, so we have next here. What's next? What's next for Libra and their person? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my, you're gonna like laugh at this person or something. Like, I, okay, Libra, I really feel soon you guys are going to laugh in this person's face. It could be an ex. I don't feel like this is somebody that you're with right now, or if you are with them, I don't know why you'd be laughing like this, but this is almost like a hyena laugh. I'm almost feeling like a, like, like, you know, a wicked witch laugh or something like, it's like, it's maniacal. It's almost like you think you won. You thought you won, have a fucking C. I heard the name Tom or Thomas. I heard have a C, have a C. Two of wands, the devil. See bitch, you can't make it up. I heard, I heard have a seat and look at her sitting down and there's the devil. Like you're calling somebody out, Libra. I don't necessarily know this is the person you're with. You could, it could be a Capricorn. It's somebody I think you've walked away from. I also heard Leo. We have the king of wands here. King and queen of wands right under it. Oh shit. Libra, I'm getting that a new connection is coming in for you and you have to take out the trash. You have to deal something with the past. You have to deal with something. Okay. I'm getting something about whoever it is that's in your energy field. It's like they're causing you heart pain. Like I'm, I'm literally feeling the heart. You see the heart. It, it, wow. It hurts. Somebody is in, influencing your new decision making, it, it, influencing your, your new relationship. Yeah. I don't like it. I don't like it. I knew it was the devil's number. Like I knew the devil was involved in this shit somehow. I don't know. The lovers, yeah? In typical tarot, the devil has two people bound. And the lovers, an angel, has two people uniting in freedom, right? It's something like, you can't have this new connection yet, Libra, because someone from the past is still impacting your ability to see men or women a certain way. Like, the kind of relationship you want, whoever the fuck this is, is still impacting you in a negative way. Libra, how does your person see you? I heard getting away, that's what I heard. The chariot, like they're getting away. So it's, it's, it is happening, you are getting away. Okay, Cancer, Capricorn. You're definitely getting away. Um, Magician in reverse, I actually think the person that you're um, leaving behind actually thinks of you as kind of a menace. They see you as doing something a little taboo with the magician here in reverse. They see you as working for the devil. It's ironic, huh? Ironic, don't you think? A little too ironic. Yeah, I really do think. This person thinks that you are somehow doing something like taboo to get out of their grasp. Lovers, bitch. I can split the deck open. There it is. It's not actually diabolical. It's not bad what you're doing, Libra. It's just that you felt, I, I heard I've fallen in love with somebody else, that's it. What's triggering right now for Libra? What's triggering for this connection? I heard everything, everything you are, two of pentacles. Everything you are is triggering them. Two of pentacles, the hermit, wow.
Judgment in reverse five. This person literally wants to go to war. Oh my God, right under the fucking five of swords of five. Listen, I'm hearing, I'm hearing your ex wants to go to war with this new person. Virgo energy. I heard, what do I have to do to win you back? I'm going to win you back. They're not taking no for an answer. This person, can, I don't know, this person can smoke cigarettes or chew tobacco or something. Cause like all of a sudden I'm, I'm tasting cigarettes in my mouth. This person, your ex. Okay. Yeah. That one. Correct. Yeah. That one. Uh, wow. Wow. They're not giving up easily. Are they? I'm hearing ex. They're getting triggered. Your ex is getting triggered. I'm hearing, I'll go to war. I'll go to war for you. Judgment in reverse. This person's willing to make a stink. They're willing to make like a big fuss. Okay. And, and I, I, I hate to say this Libra, but it's actually impacting. It's impacting like your new relationship because it's, it's it, energetically, energetically speaking, it makes you look at this new person kind of like the devil a little bit. Not, not really. I don't think that you're really going to go that far in looking at your new partner in a bad light, but I do think it's kind of, it's kind of taking its toll on your new relationship. I feel like I want to get you advice, Libra. Three of cups, exactly. There is a third party. It is your ex from the past wreaking havoc on this connection. I need to tell you that. I need to tell you that. Two of swords, yeah? And I really do need to tell you that this person is so mentally like unstable that they legit think that you would juggle them, that you would. I, I'm hearing, I'll even take that. That's fine. I'll even take that. I'll take the crumbs that you give me. I'll take breadcrumbs that you give me. That's, no, we don't do that. No, like, no, that's not how Libra is. Libra, you are too fair for that. You're not about to give anybody bread. You just, you need to let this person go and you know it. And you're like, I'm trying, I'm trying, Jenna. You just need to know that what their, what their mindset is, their, th this ex, their mindset is you haven't made up your mind yet. I know you haven't made up your mind yet. I know you haven't made up your mind yet. They have convinced themselves that you haven't made up your mind yet. Page of Pentacles. The hangman. And I also need to tell you that it's somehow impacting a new love offer coming in. Okay. The Empress could be a child too. I did hear that. I heard some about kids because I got the page pentacles with the Empress. Pisces. I heard Hispanic. This person, your ex could be Hispanic or the new person coming in Hispanic. I did hear that. Um, okay. Yeah. I just, I'm getting that um, Libra. The problem is this person, your ex, they actually do think that they still have a chance. Okay four of wands the high priestess energetically you can feel somebody new coming in and so can they but um they think that you'd be willing to just like kind of still give to them a little bit no i don't think so i don't think so i don't think libra wants that anymore wheel of fortune yeah no bitch you're like no i want the lovers and that's it i fucking right under it four of wands you're like i want this new one and that's it so i see libra you are really doing the right you're doing it right you need to keep going with that okay all right aquarius Whew. I need to get out of that energy. It's fucking hurting my heart chakra. I, the, that person, bad news. <sighs> Holy Spirit, to me in Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, please. I'm hearing, don't get it twisted. I got, I got, I heard, don't get it twisted. And then I'm seeing somebody take another person on a date. Um, like paying for something. I'm seeing a gas station though. I don't know why. I'm seeing like somebody take you on a date or a car try a car ride or tr car travel. I'm seeing somebody in a car. I okay, I'm seeing someone hold hands in a car, like a like a, a pit stop, like a gas station to like refuel or something. I'm hearing, but don't get it twisted. I don't know. It's something about like going half seas. Like like, okay, somebody here, Aquarius, like wants to really dote on you, spoil you or something. Like they're wondering. They're wondering where your level of re receptivity is. Like, how much can they give to you? Like, yeah, some, something here. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, please. Holy Spirit, between them and their person. Uh, let's go with the next. Next. We have pile. Or we have a, a, a card one. And there's a car. It just honked. Listen. The uh, bitch. Tell me I'm wrong. There's the Empress on the bottom. I just shuffled. There it is. How much are you willing to receive? Aquarius, whoever this is, really wants to give to you. Okay, they want to spoil the shit out of you. They want to spoil you rotten, this one. They want to give you everything. 
uh, I'm hearing it. I heard cloaked, cloaked. They think that you two could like disappear from the world. Like, I don't know how to describe what I'm seeing. Um, I'm hearing, I'm hearing you and I together, we can cloak ourselves. You know, I just saw that. I just saw that movie from years and years. What was it called? Time Stoppers? No, no. Yeah, Time Stoppers or Show Stop? No, wait, no. Something Stoppers. It was Time Stoppers, I think. I just saw how this person really wants to like hide away from the world with you. I'm hearing, we can stop time. We can bend time. We can like hide in plain sight. This person thinks that when you two are together, the whole world stops. I keep seeing a hummingbird. Like, you know how a hummingbird, their, their, their wings go so fast that they can't even, um, you, you can't see it. It's like you guys are vibrationally so matched, so aligned that people can't even see you anymore. You guys are like vibrating off the motherfucking map. You're, you're, <laughs> that's what I heard. I heard the map. Wow. Wow. This person wants to spoil you. Oh my God. Honey, I'm just, I cannot, I even fucking handle it. My intuition is so good. I scare myself. I scare me, myself, and I. I do. I do. I scare myself. This person, what's up next? Uh, wish fulfillment. They're going to offer you a lot of things. I'm hearing money, gifts. I want to spoil you. I heard handbags. I want to take you shopping. I'm hearing like this is, this is literally someone who has money. Okay. Why did I hear don't get it twisted? Why did I hear that? Wheel of fucking fortune. I think that spirit is telling me for you guys not to get it twisted and that you think this person is like manipulative or something with their money or like the way that they give you. It's not manipulative. It's you lit six of cups, bitch. It's literally you manifesting this person to give to you. Look at the little, look at that cutie patootie handing her the, the petunias. I don't know what that is. Look, it's adorable. I'm hearing, don't get it twisted. You are manifesting this person to give to you. You're not deceptive. You're not, you're not greedy. You're not a gold digger. You're not, no, no. It's nothing like that. Don't get it twisted. Like get out of your own head with this one. Cause you are manifesting someone to dote on you and give to you and give to you and give to you. It's like a giver. This is a giver. Okay. They are rich. I heard it. I heard it. Wheel of fortune. How, do this, how does this person see you? I heard we can stop time. Oh my God, the bitch, the Emperor, go! Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Girl, I can't even fucking handle my own intuition. Like, look at this. The time stoppers here. Look at that. Look at that boss, Zeddy. <laughs> Who wants to give to the boss mama? <laughs> okay, like, look. Look, and I'm getting something about travel. Like, this person wants to travel to you. Like. No, I'm seeing a car. I'm seeing a car. I heard plane travel for some. I'm, 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 yeah, how they see you? Like, fish. The one, the only, the empress. The one, the only, the Aquarius. Okay, yes. They think that they've been manifesting you. Again, something about travel, six of swords. I'm telling you. Bitch, tell me I'm wrong. You could try. You could put in the comments section, like, oh, you're so wrong. You're so but I would just like ignore you and delete the fuck out of you. I would, I delete it. I would delete you so fucking fast. Cause I live in the future. I live in the future where shit can't touch me cause I'm a motherfucking hummingbird. Okay. You guys, this person literally girl with the, the three, four at the timestamp, I'm getting three, four, like, like Empress and Emperor. Yeah. Three, four. Mm -hmm. They think that you guys can stop time and like people won't even bother you guys. <laughs> I heard you're two hummingbirds. Cute. You're so cute. Good. And you're flying in perfect harmony. This is so cute. Aquarius, what's triggering? What's triggering? I'm hearing others. Others are triggering us. Others. Five of cups. Other people's sadness at them. They're getting away. They're getting away and they're getting towards you. And, and other people are like really sad about it. Knight of Pentacles. What's triggering? They're taking their money with them. They're, this person is taking their money with them and heading it heading straight, straight for you. Ace of, tell me I'm wrong. Ace of Wands, I'm telling you. Fully loaded, honey. <laughs> Locked and loaded. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. They have a lot of, a lot, a lot of something, something for you. You know what I'm saying? I know you know what I'm saying. Sorry, I was just drooling there for a moment. What's some shocking news for Aquarius, please, Spirit? Ten of Wands. 
Eight of Cups. What's this? This is them getting away. You guys don't even know how good this person's gonna feel soon. Like they have never been energetically aligned with anybody ever, like in a, in a good way. They've been energetically aligned with a lot of people who de deprive them of something. I heard deprive them of grace, of mercy, of healing, of forgiveness. Three of cups, but you can't make it up. Seven of swords. Guys, what it is, though it's gonna shock you soon, is how many third parties, they have like tons of them. It's not just like one ex-girlfriend or something. This, this person, this person has so many people burdening them. And what's going to shock you soon is how willing they are to like let everybody go. Like in a matter of days. I'm hearing one fell swoop. Like this person just wants to let everything and everyone go. Bitch, tell me I'm wrong. There's the four cups. This is rejection. This is like, I don't know you. Who are you? Are you the Aquarian Empress? If the answer is no, you can get to stepping. You can get to stepping. Mm-hmm, that's what you can do. Six, honey, this person wants to give to you so much, it's insane. Oh, wow. And they're taking their money with them. I heard that, I'm taking my money with me. Cut off, I'm hearing I'm cutting you off. You have no, nothing anymore. I'm hearing like this person could have paid for somebody's phone bill or something like that. Queen of Wands in reverse, King of Cups in reverse. I hear this person's money has been like the center or foundation of like an entire group or something. Like the whole reason I heard these den of thieves, these den of vipers, these, they, 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 ugh. what I'm hearing is like, they thrived on my money. They thrived on my abundance. They thrived on me, on my energy. But I'm just looking over here at like how this emperor sees you. Look, he's like, I've got you in my sights. There is no one else. Trust me on that. Aquarius, this is so fucking delicious. I love this reading and I love you. This person is like, you are very delicious and nutritious and sexy as fuck. Perfection. This, this is great. This is the best reading by far for the air signs. I love it. I love it guys. Yeah. So this person's taking their money with them. I'm telling you King of Swords, they're laying down the law. What a beautiful reading. Honestly, they don't care about the fighting. I heard it, I heard it. I don't give a shit about the fighting. Like I know where I stand. Ooh, the emperor, ooh, the emperor. 22, 22 on the clock. I mean, I know where I stand with that, the magician. I know where the fuck I stand with that. And I know that we're manifesting this together. So I don't really care if other people want to. Wow. Yeah. They're willing, they're willing to do this, okay. They're willing to go all the way with you. Wow, this is crazy, guys. And I keep getting all the way as in like travel. Something about travel. They definitely want to travel with you, okay? All right, I love you. I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye-bye.